Well, we got two folks in studio who need no introduction. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Well, yeah, but we do need an introduction because nobody <laughs> well, can see us know, on the radio. We know if you're on or not. <laughs> Dale and Jerry, good morning. Well, that might be a good thing. <laughs> how you do, how y'all doing? What's going on? We're doing on? swell. How are you guys? We doing are awesome. good this morning. And All right. Balmy start to the day. Yeah, it's uh, nice weather. It is nice. Yeah, it is. I like this. Get you out at all, or I know you're holed up now in your studio. Getting yeah, well, no, I, yeah, but I'm still getting out. Audio narration. I'll be out. About this. Be out this afternoon. Yeah, doing some audio book narration classes. Okay. For the next four weeks, and so um, that's for to a, get, uh, uh, audio books. For yes. audio books, oh, in fact, cool. it'll be. Uh, uh, if all goes well, I'll be on audible.com. I, uh, I have a friend in Amazon California. and iTunes and all that. Yeah. Listens to those all the time. Yeah. yeah. It's all amazing to me. There's literally tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of those that have been sold. And there's uh, so many titles out there now. And it's just uh, when you think about it, you know, virtually every piece of literature is going to probably flip over to audio. Right. When you th So there should be some work out there for a guy. Yeah. You would, <laughs> you would think, you know, so. Very excited about that, and um, uh, very encouraged. Had one class, and we have a questions and answers uh, session tomorrow sure. night. So, yeah, it's oh, really wow. exciting. That's about thirty of us from around the country this this winter session that they're doing right now. So, so everybody's chiming in where they're from, and I'm the only one from Washington State that's in class. Uh -huh. Two people from Cleveland, <laughs> lots from Los Angeles and I California, bet. of and course, that sort of area. So. But that's cool. Yeah. Couple Representing of, the Cal or Washington. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. Couple from like the United Kingdom or whatever. Some, you know, different time zones involved in all this. So they they list all these different time zones for classes and everything. That's, that's pretty cool. cool. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. exciting. Is this your first kind of online class like this? Yeah. 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 So but he's always enjoyed talking to himself. <laughs> so well, we know this. So I'm still talking to myself, but sometimes there's some other people listening. Now, so. <laughs> and and th therein lies the good thing of the class. The dogs and I are loving it. <laughs> the dog. Riley's uh, uh, putting on a few pounds here because he's not going for a walk every two hours. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> and he's out of my kitchen. <laughs> Just don't read any books with phrases like, come here, good boy, treat time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Speak. <laughs> speak, especially. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God, yeah. Because he does come up and speak to you in a loud, loud bark. So, so that's what I'm going to be kind of dabbling in. Of course, cool. uh, we've got a lot of exciting events coming up, including... The Valentine's Dessert Auction and Luncheon for United Way this Friday. Friday. So that's from uh, noon till 2, I guess, is what the flyer says. Mm -hmm. And so uh, give yourself a little extra time on this Friday getaway day and come over and join us at the Civic Center if you haven't already got your tickets. And fun. It'll be a lot of fun. It's very successful and a great uh, fundraiser for United Way of Mason County. Fun stay. Here, yeah. So oh, very. Good. That's yeah. the emphasis yeah. on that. And the desserts sure. are outrageously mm. good. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I'm still doing jury duty. So far, so good. Okay. Eight down, two to go. Uh -huh. and I haven't been called yet, but Friday I'm double booked here. I got jury duty, and so Jeff's my backup. He's <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll try. I'll try to my best. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. But Poor I got Jeff. two more shots uh, at, for them to last well, sue me, or else I'm out. Days that you'll get called in. Yeah, it'll be Friday. Probably be Friday. Of course. Flaps <laughs> day. Sequestered. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Once again. Where's, where's Dale been for a couple of weeks? Poor right. house. Jerry said, I don't know. I don't care. Yeah, yeah. Well, oh, darn. <laughs> You're busy. I'll have to go to that luncheon myself. <laughs> Give me your credit card. <laughs> what have you been up to, Jerry? Well, I've been meeting with different people around town, not, uh -huh. a, not a lot, about different subjects that we'll tell you about later. want to urge everybody to be sure they, if they haven't voted, that they yeah. vote. If, if um, they get their ballot. Right. Right. It, because it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be real interesting to see the outcome of the first round at the city. Yeah. And, and everybody, just to put another point on that, you get to vote in all the districts. Right. It's not like... Uh, so you, you get to vote for all the districts. Yeah. yeah, it's not like you see the names and then go, but I'm not in their district. Yeah, no, you like vote But are the actual the districts? Choices. I no, thought they were not. just they're positions. Not. They're just open positions. Open positions, right. and they're just numbered. Yeah. Right. So, so you vote for four people. Yeah, you'll have to vote for, you'll choose four of those folks. Yeah, okay. Looking at uh, some of the uh, numbers, uh, interested in how the budget actually turns out with the forecast, what what they ask everybody to do, is county budget, ask everybody to cut 17.5% mm -hmm. of their budgets. When you look at the total roll-up, 
uh, of the initial look that I saw of the numbers was only a reduction of about 3.99%. So looking at that, uh, they're still scrubbing the numbers, but I'll bring that back. Okay. That's one of the things I've been looking at. Uh, one February. of the big aha ones was a matter of the effect that the um, – the layoffs had to the budget because when they laid off people or they retire, we have a couple senior people out of the sheriff's department that are retiring, a couple others. Those people have been here for years and years, and and what they haven't spent in terms of their vacation oh, yeah. or their uh, comp time, they get in cash, and so that has an impact on the budget that wasn't necessarily. Oh, in the, the numbers, of, of, in yeah. the numbers. So there's huh. a there's a line item called um, non departmental, and that's where the health care and all that kind of stuff comes out, and and that gets budgeted based on cost of head head count or cost of health care per head count or whatever. Huh. Anyway, there's some some discrepancy in that, that actual budget reduction. It's always something. Oh, for sure, for mm -hmm. sure. And I uh, wanted to. Um, you know, just bring up Ron Pinnell. Yeah. It's, and recognize him and everything he's done for the community because we lost him. Yeah. I think Don is mm -hmm. planning something on Saturday at the Civic Center. Is she? Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah we'll get more details on we'll that. find that out. Oh, but, yeah. you know, he was one of the founders of the Pancake mm -hmm. Breakfast. I mean, there's a lot mm -hmm. of different things that he's been involved in along with the, the Kiwanis. And whatnot, and then most the the thing and picture in my mind is this little guy running down or not running, walking up and down the streets picking up trash. Uh -huh. And we go, who is that homeless person? Oh, <laughs> this yeah. is Ron Pinnell, and he did uh, that what a not good man. Yeah, he did he did that routinely. He demonstrated the actions that we expect of everybody yeah. right. and everybody says oh yeah i do that i do that well who in the hell do you see out there yeah. it was ron no, I it love was that. ron it, it ron was yeah oh yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. and never and totally unassuming never really uh ever looked for any recognition it's just that's what he that was him so always good times with him and the guys recording those commercials. oh my gosh oh. Just yeah the yeah right and those, uh, I think Dave Thatcher was part of that group with the uh, original Pancake Breakfast and that. And what they did with when they organized that, that was a group of businessmen that decided that there were several kids that had drowned out at Panhandle Lake. Yeah, one of I, the lakes around here. Yeah, anyway, oh, it turns out to be down uh, Golden Pheasant Road, that one down yeah. there. Anyway... So they decided they were going to raise some money to uh, get swim lessons for the kids so that there wouldn't be any drowning. And that oh. started way back when. In the 50s. Yeah. Yeah, they're up to their near 70th anniversary. Yeah. Wow, that's too long. And it was yeah. such a successful event, they kept going on. And, and I'm so glad that he was finally recognized as Man of the Year oh, for, yeah. by the Chamber. I don't know how many times he was put up as, for Man of the Year, and for whatever reason, he, he was never given that. But mm -hmm. he has definitely done a lot for this this uh, community, and we really appreciated that. Yeah. Yeah, seven forty-five at I five hundred one. So uh, again, a reminder that the uh, Valentine's auction, uh, another way for you to give back to the community. Oh uh, yeah, Friday coming yeah. up here. Yeah, that'll be a lot of fun. We tell twelve to two, and the plunge is on Saturday. Yeah, oh, and yeah. Uh, hours for people who want to go out to the plunge. Eleven to two. Eleven till two. Beautiful. Okay, mm -hmm. we'll have uh, some music, and then Stan Yanis and the Windjammers will be uh, yeah. playing. Yeah, yeah. And so we'll be oh, doing fun. calls for raffles and yeah. letting people get out there, jump on into that cold water. But it won't be too bad if it's going to be like this. Fifties. Yeah, yeah, and the weekend yeah. is supposed and to actually have sunshine, yeah. so it'll yeah, be one of the nicer day. days ever for this yeah, sort of really thing. The it raffle is. gifts are good. Yeah. They really, you really can get uh, some nice stuff. Yeah. So. Right. Yeah, it's, it's going to be in the fifties on uh, Saturday. It'll be awesome. perfect. Yeah. It, but that fifty degree weather still, when you jump into that 50, 40 degree water, it'll feel warm when you get out. Oh yeah. 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 <laughs> it'll be balmy. Yeah, you know, be careful you don't get heat stroke. <laughs> balmy. Anything else, Dale? Well, there is a uh, tribal fisheries forum going on today in the new Skokomish uh, Cultural Center okay. on Highway One Hundred and One. It's an all-day event, and I'm not. I think it was. Uh, I'm not sure that it's by invitation. I think they have. It's open to the public, 
Um, however, uh, they did want RSVP uh, for that, so they knew how to how to plan for it. Oh, yeah. There are some people in the community that are attending that today, and okay. that's going to be a big event. And so there's an exceptional amount of traffic up in that area today. Very good. I think that's about. Uh, well, speaking of traffic, yesterday I took a trip into Olympia. And we had more traffic in Mason County than in, on my way from uh, Olympia to Pacific Avenue. Uh -huh. It was uh, kind of like, what? And more our problem with traffic is the one and two lane highways oh, yeah. that uh, we deal with all the time. So, huh. but uh, people moving about. Yeah. Commerce. 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 Yeah, well, yeah, we like to stop some of that commerce. And, <laughs> and it was interesting your discussion on that or in the news about the hall industries and that. You know, time is money, and we know why, because over time, things change. Uh -huh. And guess what, Mr. Hall? <laughs> if you fail to move on something, people don't stop with their, the other progress that happens. And Like sands of an hourglass, oh. the world's always turning. Well, yeah, yeah. I in there. think yeah. there's a day... <laughs> Time soap opera. These are the days of our lives. There it is. All right. Good to see you guys.